Former Bangladeshi High Commissioner to Malaysia, Mohamed Khairuzaman, who was detained for six days for overstaying, told FMT recently that the arrest did not surprise him. He said he is aware that the Bangladeshi government is intent on extraditing him because of his alleged involvement in the 1975 jail killings of four top leaders of the Awami League, the current ruling government in Bangladesh. The High Commission started to inquire about me eight months ago through various Bangladeshi nationals living here, he said. In 1996, he spent nearly five years behind bars after he was recalled from Manila, where he was then serving as his country's envoy. The Bangladeshi government accused him of involvement in the murder of four aides of the country's founding father, Sheikh Mujibur Rahman, in a case known as the jail killings. The country's courts eventually acquitted Kairu Zaman, who then got his job back through an administrative tribunal before rising up the ranks in the foreign ministry and being posted to Myanmar and Malaysia as High Commissioner. But this year, media reports in Bangladesh had quoted government officials as saying that Kairu Zaman should be brought back to face charges once again for the 1975 killings. These claims are all fabricated, he said. The government just wants political mileage and to divert attention away from the present crisis it is facing. However, the former diplomat, who holds a UNHCR card that allows him to stay in Malaysia, chose not to elaborate. On February 15, the Kuala Lumpur High Court granted an interim order against the Immigration Department's intention to deport Kairo Zaman to Dhaka. I want to thank the Malaysian government and the judiciary system for this, he said. I also appreciate the Immigration Department for treating me well during my arrest. I do not think I will get a fair trial if I return.